there, and I am Sparky from Walk and Get Lost. Patches is videoing today. I have lumber. I'm going to create a little rack shelving unit and for the inside of the trailer. And uh, yeah, here we go. The shelf is now built. Oh, it is. Did such a good job. He didn't draw plans or anything. It's really kind of cool watching you do what you do, babe. Well, thanks. 
So, yeah, kind of recess the top, if you will, so that way our grill, our stove, that kind of stuff can go up here. I'm gonna figure out something different for the propane so it doesn't. Yeah, the uh, propane's not gonna ride there for the truck. No, nah, we need to secure it better. Yeah, and then here is the firewood. Check your state and your local. I would say ODNR, but that's Ohio Department of Natural Resources. Uh, check your Department of Natural Resources. Make sure you're allowed to move wood. We actually can only use wood in our county when we camp. Not allowed to move it outside of the county. Um, Emerald ash borer is the problem, although that's maple, so. Um, yeah, we're kind of getting organized. Take it away, Patches. Yeah. <laughs> So what do you want to look at? What do you want to look at the front? What I call the front, but it's really the back. But it seems like the front because that's like where I am. And it's at the front. So on the little on the left, that little box has our ratchet straps and paracord for our kayaks. We still need to get the ladder rack, but we're not kayaking this trip, so it's not a big deal. Um, and that's our fleet of lanterns. Two of them are like awesome fam combo. We need to figure out what we're gonna do for that too for the trip. Um, the green foot locker is, I call it the junk drawer of camping gear. It has like our metal plates and metal cups and silverware. It has a lot of stuff that should go in a chuck box, which we are totally making a chuck box in the fall. Sparky's super excited about that. It also has like clothes pins and fire start sticks and deck of uno. A deck of Uno. Uno. Regular decks. Yes. Uno is super important to our family. We always take Uno when we go camping. Oh, the Scary Stories books. The Scary Story books, yes, yeah. Yes, you got to have the campfire stories. Um, and then, like, our jug of water for when we're, like, uh, today is Saturday. And we are going to be camping on Friday. And there's no electric or potable water at our site. So that's our water jug. I think it's five. Yeah, it says five on it. The black tote is what we call our food tote. We'll take that in the house, load it up with bread, buns, chips, all the stuff that we don't want to get smashed. And then that'll probably ride in the car because the trailer gets pretty hot. Yeah, it really does. Um, and back towards the back, you can kind of see like a big little main tote. That is all of our sleeping bags. Um, and then in between the shelf, you can kind of see one sticking out. We actually have three tents. Um, and we'll probably do a video on all of those. We have, what we're probably going to use is our big eight person tent, but it fits our family perfectly. Um, we also have a teepee tent and like a little man, uh, a little two, two man. Yeah. Yeah. yeah two man, uh, dome tent. That's the word, right? Dome mm -hmm. tent. Uh, and the kayaking paddles, we put those in a five gallon bucket. Probably going to have to figure out a way to make sure those don't go yeah, we still need to get stuff secured. Today it was pretty much just building the shelf, getting that in there, and then trying to figure out the rest of the organization. Um, I think she said the sleeping bags are all in that green tote. Uh, we've got our easy up, uh, 10 by 10 easy up, bungeed to the back wall there. All of our life jackets. All of our life jackets. Including Cosmo. <laughs> including the dogs. Um, little portable toilet back there that you can't see a little flush camp toilet. Oh yes, case, those are nice. case you need that while you're out. Hey okay, man, sometimes you're super duper far away from the toilet. Um, I think that is pretty much it for the trailer for now. Once we add more organization to it, we will do more and let you see. That's it. That's it. Oh, if you liked what you saw today, uh, there's more videos on our channel. We would love to hear what you thought of um, our video today. Any organization tips, because, you know, we definitely need some help, as you can see. <laughs> um, so please comment any tips or tricks or ideas. Um, and check out our channel. And if you want to join us as we hike, kayak, camp with a tent, bicycle, mainly around Ohio. Oh, yeah. One more thing, I guess. The... Uh med kit we keep here handy at the back in case we need to send somebody to run and grab it quickly they don't have to dig through anything to find the med kit so yeah that's oh and beastie for. can reach it that's and, super important yeah beastie can reach it that is important 
she might need a band-aid and some Neosporin. Always. <laughs> Alright, well, thank you guys for watching, and uh, tune in next time. <laughs>